So that group that you just saw was the Cedar Cliff High School Octet. It's an eight-person select group that meets after school, selected from amongst the chamber singers. Uh, and they come, they volunteer their extra time before rehearsals, after rehearsals. They go and do lots of gigs uh, out in the community and have a lot of fun. And they're very, very um, self-sufficient. They just go. I can send them. Uh, and they're just wonderful to work with. Now, you may be wondering why Victor's standing up here. It's because we have a special offering for you this evening uh, from Victor. Uh, Victor Victor uh, composed a piece that he's been working on, and he just told us today, I know he's been working on it a long time, three years he's been working on this piece and adding to it and building this piece. I've heard it a little bit, um, well, everyone's heard little bits of it in the choir room over the last three years. Um, if you see Victor, there's like a nine out of 10 chance he's playing piano, and if he's not playing piano, the one out of 10 chance is he's singing. Uh, Victor has been kind of a, a figure in the uh, music community, and he's a senior this year, and I'm really, um, both happy for him to go out in the community and we'll definitely miss his presence, his piano playing, and all those things in the chorus room. This piece, Tempest Winds, is his own composition. Uh, and I encourage you today when we were in here and kind of, it, it, it takes you on a journey. Uh, he's gonna say a few words about it, so I'll let him explain it um, and let the artist kind of talk about it a little bit. But for me, I close my eyes and see what images I can make up in my head when I'm hearing it and see where it will transport me to. So I encourage you to do that as well. Victor, you wanna say a few things about your piece? This is a very emotional time because this is one of the last few times where I'll get to perform piano in front of a high school an audience. Well, an audience for a high school concert anyways. Um, yeah. I, I've been working on this piece for three years since my sophomore year and during my sophomore year it was a pretty hard time because COVID had just hit, everyone was coming back to school, did this stupid uh, cohort day thing. It was, it was really dumb. Um, <laughs> but <laughs> all of us can agree to that. <laughs> uh, okay. Um, <laughs> I'm making jokes so I don't cry. Um, so it really gave me time to reflect on all the things that had been wrong with my freshman year and how I could improve myself. And then I was, I was like, why don't I just compose a piece of music about it? And then it dragged on for three more years, and here we are. So I'm going to let you guys just, whatever images you can come up with in your head, like, just do it. Yeah. <laughs> 